okay so in the my first video so we already seen that how to install the zam uh, into the windows servers and uh, right now just we are going to check that how to point how to point a domain uh, in domain in it means the live domain so how to point in the zam in the live server so i already have that zam set up and i'm just going to that point my domain so first of all i have been checked that uh, my ip address is the public ip address and then i, I have that uh, domain and i just change the ip okay so after that uh, i have been checking that the, the domain is pointing Yeah, it's pointed to that uh, it's already binding, but it's not pinging because I'm not uh, enabling the ICMP port. So that's the reason why it is not open. So the thing is that the main thing is that for the firewall, Windows have the firewall and uh, we can check that the domain are open or not. yeah you can you can see that the check the proxy settings and firewall running windows network and diagnostic so we have to check that the firewall and allow that the so if we, if we just disable the firewall for the temporary purpose so now we can check yes that is the open okay so but that is the no, not the solution so we enable that and we just allow from the advanced settings to the port 80 the inbound rule new rule port for the 80 and ok so let's one time check here and allow the connectivities domain the name would see http dash in and also we are doing the same thing in the port tcp at allow HTTP push out. We have been that the two rules already set up in and out. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we are not close our SSL uh, firewall is on. So we change something into that. HT docs we just rename that create a domain is working so thanks for watching 
you have been seen that how to point a live domain uh, into the AWS and also that the Windows Server XAMPP installations. Thank you. Thanks for watching.